welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be unboxing the Season House decor box for April of 2023. Now if you're unfamiliar with Season House decor, now if you're unfamiliar with the Season House home decor subscription, it is a monthly home decor subscription that delivers curated home decor to help celebrate the season. And each box has six carefully curated items inside to help get you ready for the season, the holiday, whatever is coming up. Um, it has like boutique holiday and seasonal decor inside and whatever's inside will kind of reflect the current holiday season. So the colors, textures and all that kind of stuff will reflect the season. Now I'll be honest, this is my very first time unboxing this box. So I have no idea what's inside. I have no idea what to expect, but I can say that I'm very excited to get inside. Uh, the box is $79.99 a month plus shipping. I believe if you sign up for longer subscription periods, it does get a little bit cheaper. Cheaper. And with that, welcome back to all the Subbox lovers out there. Welcome if you're new. My name is Katrina and on my channel I unbox lots of different subscription boxes. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And let's dive in. I am so happy that you're here hanging out with me today unboxing this box for the first time. It's like it's a pretty good sized box, so I'm excited to see what's inside. Now, in order to get the April box, which is the one that I'm kind of sneak peeking and unboxing today, you do have to sign up by April 9th. Um, so make sure you sign up by that date if you want to get the box that I'm unboxing here. There is on top a little card that says thank you for supporting our small business, which is so cute. And then there's a QR code um, that you can scan to get their um, guide or booklet. Now we're obviously in the springtime, so this is gonna be a springtime box. And the very first thing that I am pulling out here is this beautiful wreath. Oh my goodness. Now it's obviously a faux wreath, um, but it looks honestly, it's like it looks real to me. Like it like even from like this, like it's you have to like do a double take to realize that it's faux. This is so so pretty. You could hang this on a door. Does it smell good? It kind of smells good. <laughs> um, you could also use this as like a table place and put like a candle or put some sort of like decor piece in the middle of it if you wanted to do that. The leaves are really soft. I don't know if they're made of like, I think they're made of like a foamy type material. They're very soft and it just is so, so pretty. Now I will say when I'm getting this box, I am getting this box early. So when I scan the code, it doesn't show here what I have. So I don't have like the details of the booklet, but if you got it, the new booklet would be up at that time. Um, so I just don't have like extra info, but it is such a pretty wreath. And this one I love because while it obviously screams spring, I feel like this is one that could be beautiful in the winter, in the summer, like it goes a lot, like it can go with a lot of different seasons and decor. And I love a good fresh pop of greenery. Okay, up next we have this. I have no idea what this is. Oh, this is stunning. It's made in Kenya. Um, I'm assuming probably handmade and it's a beautiful, it's a stone just that, so you know, like a solid piece of like, m not marble, not stone. I don't know what it is, but it's a beautiful bird. Oh, I love it. And it's like kind of not like heavy, heavy, but it has weight to it because it's a bird could be used as a paperweight, but wow, I love that. I love like simplistic, simple design. So I like absolutely love this and it feels really, really nice on the hand because of the stone. It's very cooling. It's almost like, like, I don't know, calming in a way. <gasps> uh, stunning. Ah, okay. There's actually more on that, on this. So it's a hand carved Kissy soapstone or Kizzy soapstone. This is an art artisan partnership, um, with the Vanille self help group. So these are hand carved from one piece of soapstone with a machete and then wet sanded smooth. Um, some remain their natural stone color and others are dyed bright colors and etched. By purchasing this piece, you're partnering with artisans in Kenya to create employment opportunities. And this is a fair trade federation member. Oh, that makes it so much more special. I love that. And inside we have a little sign that says, hello spring. It's very, very cute. I will say personally, I don't like like lettering and stuff, but this one is very, very cute. Like I don't like signs that have sayings, but I will say this is very, very cute. Like it's like made with like boards like that. I love the flowers for spring. It's six by six. And if you, you could always DIY this and paint it and do something different with it if you wanted to, but I still think it is super cute. Like this with a little bird next to it, like it's like, oh, that would be so cute for spring. So a nice little like wooden, Hello, a spring sign from Sincere Surroundings. All right, up next we have this here. And at first I was like, oh, is it a table runner? But these are all separate. Are these napkins? 
I think these are napkins because they look too, they're too square to be a table runner. Oh, it says something here. Yes. Madeline yellow napkin, 18 inches by 18 inches. These are 100% cotton and made in India. Ooh, these are really nice. I love them with the fringe on the sides. Oh, and they're 100%, I love when we get like 100% cotton things because it's just so nice for like a napkin. And what's nice about this, I got six. I was just, I feel like a lot of times you get like four or sometimes even sets of two in subscription boxes, but this came with six, which to me is like a full set, especially if you're having guests and hosting. So it's got this beautiful kind of like cream beige color. And then you've got these beautiful yellow lines going through. Um, and again, 18 by 18 inches, some nice little napkins. If you're having a little spring feast, um, these are really, really pretty and they feel very nice quality. So this is really exciting. A nice little spring moment. All right. And then we have another mystery box. All right. It's all in styrofoam. All right. And inside we get this beautiful train. I will say, unfortunately mine came apart. There's glue there and it just came unglued, which I, it'll be pretty easy to glue back together. If that happens to you, reach out to them to customer service and they can help resolve it. But Oh my goodness. I don't know what it's made out of, but it's like, I don't know, but it's this beautiful green color to be honest. Um, you know, you could even put this on the top of it and like have it be like a moment. Um, I think it's really, really stunning. Or you could put your little birdie and your hello spring sign on top. Of course, I'm holding it up like it's a plate. It w I can just, like I said, not hard to glue back on. This is what it looks like. This beautiful, like light green color for spring. I think it's absolutely stunning. That's absolutely not what I was expecting to come out of that box. I don't know what I was expecting, but it absolutely was not this, which is just so, so beautiful. I don't have anything this color, but I really like this color and this color actually will play very nicely with the other decor that I have in my apartment. So I'm excited y'all. All right, and that is everything in the season house decor box for April. I thought it was really, really fun. You get some really cool, unique items that are perfect for spring. So if you're looking for a home decor subscription um, that comes on a monthly basis and it gets you ready for the season, this is the box for you. Um, I will leave a link down below in case you're interested in signing up. I'm curious though, what are your thoughts? What do you think of everything in the box? I think my favorite thing is the little birdie because I just love the little birdie, but everything in here is really great. But again, would love to hear your thoughts. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you in my next video.